How about that? I've just unclipped the external microphone. Does that work better? Can you hear me now? Anything? Ah, there you go. Right. So there was a problem with the, having the external microphone connected. Uh, is there any wind noise? Any wind noise or can you hear me all right? No, that's cool. So, I'm just using up some old worms that I had from my session the other day. And I thought it would be nice to have, to have a go at the live stream because somebody asked me. Oh, that's good. Thank you. Somebody asked me if I was going to do a live stream. And I did one with my giveaway. And I thought, you know what? Why not? The only thing I was worried about was the old um, wind noise, but there seems to be no wind. Ah, oh, that's good. Thanks, Pat. There is uh, a bit of rain, though. Hello, one of the aircraft carriers is not there. I didn't know they went out. Yeah, so I, I forgot my reading glasses, but I can see the phone at a distance. I'm not getting your comments come up regularly so I don't know why I just get them flash up when you actually talk when you actually say something so forgive me if I don't answer all the comments as I'm a newbie at this live fishing I don't know what's going to happen I've got to investigate it a bit more that's I haven't really Sorted out any rigs or anything I was going to use today either. I haven't got any of my cotton bud rigs. What's this one? This is. Yeah, it looks like a little a flapper rig that I tied. What am I after? Fish. Thank you very much. I expect there might be some wrasse about. And that was all I was thinking at daytime. I don't know where else I could. I need to touch the screen. I've touched the screen. I don't know what that's about. How many days have I been fishing in a row? Now I fish like every other day or every third day or something. Now I came down here because I thought this would probably be the only place that I could, well not that I could only, but my best place to catch a fish, or my best chance of catching a fish here. Now do you know what, did I bring any? No, I was going to bring some paper clips to use as a uh, bottom bottom, but I haven't got any. But I've got, I'm going to use some of these uh, weights today, because I don't mind if I lose those, the old cartridge weights. So, that's the start. We've got a rod, we've got a reed, we've got a weight. And I think. Yes, and I've got my worms. Are they still alive? Yes, they are. So I've still got some ragworm. I don't know why, but on the bottom of my screen, I've got a lot of pictures of me. Like I say, I don't understand this live streaming yet. So, size four, chinoo. Bit of ragworm. I'm gonna miss the head. What have I got? I've got um, a little spinning rod and my old 
spod rod that I use for back filling. Because I thought, you know, that's that old Cypriness rod. I thought there might be a chance of a late mackerel because I know somebody was down here the other day catching them. I'm not tipping with anything today. Just little bits of worm, just like that, look. Tap the screen above and the pictures swipe up. The pitch, no, they're still there. I don't know what to do with them. Okay, Vinny. So Vinny's popping down as well. Yeah, I'll worry about the whole live stream thing in a minute. I've got to get my bait out. So what's that? 45 people watching? Well that's a surprise. Didn't think anybody was going to watch it. So there we go. Two up flapper with ragworm. Straight into the blooming eye with the swivel. Like I always say, there's always something with me. Right. So now. Just going to chuck it out there. Round about where I was getting the rats the other day for the moment. Just to see. Now. If I'll bring this over here, I don't know where you'll see the rod tip best. Can you see the rod tip? If I move you, yeah, you can just about see the rod tip, I think. You're not, I've got you on the railing, but you're not, um, not very firm on the railing there. There you go. You can see a bit of the spinnaker as well. So that rod I've just chucked out is a Silver Max spinning rod. And this one is the old Cypress one that I've been using for a couple of years. Right, the rain's getting a bit, uh, just cover the rag where I'm over. Did I bring another hat apart from my hood? No, I didn't. I was out in a bit of a rush, so. If it gets too much, I'll step my hood up, otherwise I won't bother. Right, let me just get this one. So there's nobody down here fishing. A couple of people walking around in front of the pub. Just to tighten that up. There we go. There you go, there's bites on that already. Not surprised. Oh hello, it's conflict. This pen pursuit doesn't have a... What do you call it? Switch to go reverse. A reverse switch. That bite didn't come to anything then? Put your phone on portrait. Okay, thank you. Yeah, I'll have a look at the phone in a minute. Let me just get my second rod out. I don't like being out and not having my rods in the water. There you go, there's a bite. Oh, that looks more than a bite, doesn't it?
Nog. Thought we had a fish then, guys. Yeah. Biting again. Right, you gonna let me set the second rod up or not? So, what else should I chuck out? I've got this uh, three hooker with the bigger hooks on. So I might as well chuck that out to the deeper channel. Yeah, hang on a minute. Have we got a fish on here? Right, what was I doing? Yes. So I've got the weight out. Now I'm going to stick my hood up for a minute. I didn't check the forecast before I came out, so I've no idea. I know it was due to rain solidly for five days, but me being me, I thought, well, I'm going to go fishing. And like you saw the other night, if I'm going fishing, I don't care what the weather's doing really. Now, I think, ah, I've got a clip on that one, that's cool. So the clip there can go into the top of the rig, like that. Ah, now that was a bigger bite. Be able to concentrate more once I've got this southern rod in the water. And then I'll have a look at the phone and see if I can sort out, get rid of those stupid pictures of me and see if I can see your comments. Actually, I think I'll probably have a look at that, uh, the bait and the other one first. So this one is three hooks, and these are the bigger ones. I think these are one o's. I was saying the other night, I think they're one o's. Don't think they're ones. So this one I'm gonna chuck out towards the Spinnaker Tower, because it's a deeper mark out there. So the other one will stick around where the rats are, and then this one will chuck out in the hope of a bass or a bream or anything that might be kicking around. Yeah, it looks like the... Uh... Might have disappeared on that one. The pace, because I wasn't actually on the rod at the time. Come from one of the Isle of Wight ferries coming in. Gotta see how close she's coming in. She's gonna be in the channel that I was gonna chuck my bait out into. Oh, by the way, um, I think we're an hour or so before high tide, I can't remember. Half past one high tide or something. Yeah, I can't clip this one up because I haven't got a, a clip on my way. Never mind, doesn't matter. Alright, let's have a look at this one while the ferry's coming in.
got it. And all the bait's gone, so no surprise there then with those bite holes having. But this this smaller one's on the size four chinooks, so they've got to be small if they didn't hook themselves. Right over the deep water where I want to go, but with the angle of the line through the water, I reckon I'll still be okay. I just chuck this uh, small hook one back out. I've aimed that one. And there you go, right in the deep water there. Can you see both the tips all right? Can you see the tips? I don't know. Look, I'm gonna have a look at this phone now. I'm gonna put you on portrait. It's telling me to rotate the device, but I've not got rid of that stupid thing on it with all those pictures of me. Are ya? I don't know if it's stupid, Chess Chessel's great, but it fishes well. Yeah, there's a cross up here, but if I cross that, I'm worried I'm not gonna stop the live stream. But I've got the, all these photos of me down the bottom. I can't get rid of them. Hello, Reese. Well, I'm gonna just stick you back where you were because I wish I hadn't moved you now. Can you see those rods? Yes, you can. Right, just tighten up on these. Got little hooks on the one that's closest to us, bigger hooks on the other one. It's a nice boat going in down the harbour. Yeah, you're a bit far from me up there. I don't know how close I can get you. Just take you over this. I got you actually sat on the railings. So I'll just move you over that bit and then I can slide you in closer if you want. Does that still look alright? Yeah, I think it does. All we've got to do is get a fish. Now that had a bite on it. What does the bike got? Move it. Because there's a lot of weeds down there. You've got to just move it down again. Just to move it out the way. Let's look to see how much bite I've got. Yeah, there's enough for a good couple of hours there, I reckon. Oh, 
Top book stripped, the bottom book top. Some reason my phone wouldn't let it turn around into portrait. I tried. I know, there's a little bird down there, I don't know what that is. No, I've got a clue. Looks like some sort of pepper, I don't know. Hello. Are the other rod just boomed, isn't it? on this one. You know what? I'm going to leave that, guys. I keep going back to it too quickly. Do you know anything about live streaming? I've got a load of... I've got a load of stupid pictures at the bottom of my phone of me. So I'm just going to have a look. I've got a load of pictures there. Down, get it Mate, I've tried that. Look. No, pull the pictures down. And I can't get rid of the damn things. No. You should be able to. Well, and right. well, I can't read my comments either. One of your settings, that's just to change the picture style. Yeah, but it didn't it wasn't there when I started streaming. And I don't know why it's there. Oh right, I see. I mean I can live with it because they're not seeing it. All they're seeing is the big thing at the back, but I'm not seeing their comments. When they comment it comes up, but it like that, and it disappears again. Yeah. Listen, if you can't do anything, there you go. Way, I've done it. I've done it. Well, done it. What did you do? Circle. Oh, brilliant. There you go. I can see my ugly face now. Um, <laughs> it's these young kids, they know what they're doing with these bloody things. <laughs> oh, hang on. I'm going to watch my language now, these two are here. Hi, oh, sir. Yeah, you're well, I spent a long time at home yeah. trying to sort out an external mic, but I didn't get the, the wind noise. So it's too bad. Any time I've done it before, I've got an external mic. I had it plugged in and replaced that thing with the thing is, it's some... Um, you know what? You put an hour, I need to charge it. I need to get a shot. Uh, you should be able to do it. Uh, when it goes to the next one, it goes to the next one, you should be able to do it. There's a new one here. Right. 
my eye going to worry when it's out. Right, how many we got watch? A uh, 73. Lovely weather. Something on that. Something on what? Don't start that shit again. <laughs> No, can't see anything. Hang on, Simon just said biscuits. Biscuits? What do you want, Sam? No, I'm all right, mate. <laughs> what you got in your hand? I don't. Oh, no, I'm going to get back in there. No, yeah, yeah. Oh, right. No, I don't know. I'm a bit warm with it on. Well, come on, then you said there's something on that. What? No bites at the moment, guys. Oh, look at this. I can see everything. No fish yet, no. I'll watch you while you're working. Well, get on and do some work. <laughs> what species am I after? Fish species. I will check this little one because this does get. Are you mackerelling as well tonight? Come on, give it Are you? Yeah. Well, I've got some feathers down just in case because Ed got some this week, didn't he? I've had, I've had a couple. Have you? I've had, I've had the benches. You've had what? I've had mackerel and the benches. Have you? There you go. Feathers are not feathers. That's because I'm talking <laughs> to Simon. The bait's all gone. I'm going to concentrate on this, see if we can actually get a film of me, a video, live video of me actually catching a wrasse. Because that's all that's nicking the worms. Don't need to put big bits on these little hooks. But what I'll do this time, I'll not let the rod go, I'll hold the rod. See if we can get the little bone bone. Just out there. Right. Trouble is, I'm too far from the phone. I can't read your comments now. <laughs> no, that's gone. Never mind. Right. There. Right. Oh. Fish on, guys. Fish on. At last. Air feels brilliant on this little one. Wow! Good God alive! Look at the size of that one! <laughs> Jesus! I wasn't expecting to catch that. I was expecting to catch babies, not bloody clunkers. Wow! Good God! Hey, sorry about the language, but look, look at that. Yeah, that's the biggest one I've caught down here for a long time. Fantastic! Um, yeah. yeah. You got to get your account now. I've got to get my account now, yeah. Excuse me, you got my hook? I didn't bring any bloody things, did I? I wasn't expecting to catch fish. Pliers. Wowza! All right! Right. <laughs> See the operating table. Oh, hello. hello. Yeah, there you go. Uh, I'm live streaming on YouTube. If you don't want to be on it, then... There you go, look. Wow. Just going to try and get the hook out. Trouble is, these things have got teeth. What is it? It's a rat. Tasty? No. Um, <laughs> apparently, <sighs> no, I can't get it. Apparently, they're too bony. But um, that's not a bad size fish. No. Are you any good? At, uh, it's quite deep. If I hold it, you don't need to do it on the camera. No. Well, I'll 
can have it. He's got his fingers in his mouth. He's got teeth, mate. You can have lose There you go. You are a star. There you go. Sorry, we just, um, I don't know how to put that. Right. Let's go back in. Well, I can go home now. Get in! Whoop whoop! How do the fish know I'm on YouTube? Mate, how many little fish have I caught here? Oh, yeah, long, long time. I don't even think the one on South Bay Pier was that big. That was me and you on the pier when I had it, wasn't it? Oh, okay. I mean, I know they get huge, but that's still a nice video. Yeah, but not from here. Stupid hooks. Stupid little rod. Stupid, that's on your back. Thank you very much. That was on my what? Back one. Yeah. That's all I've got, mate. I'll use my rag up first, guys. Simon, why did you put your finger in there? I always worry about the teeth. You used to put the point around and things like that, push it down, and pull the point out. And that's what this water does, mate. Yeah, pretty much, yeah. But... You don't use to put anything. No, no, no. What, what about the teeth in them? Sorry, plug the teeth. Yeah, I don't know about that. <laughs> what about you, Billy? Really? Would you put your... Your finger in a brass's mouth? Dogfish? <laughs> <laughs> you know what? I didn't even know dogfish had teeth. I keep putting my finger in there. There. Well, I'm talking to the thing. I'm live streaming on YouTube. On YouTube. Oh look, there's natural geese. Geese. Uh, I think that might be a double. Right, well, I'm going to check the other one. I think that one. Yeah, but they can't see it, so they can't see it. Oh, let's see what we got. Oh, 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 what'd you get? What'd you get? Oh, let's see, let's see. The pot of books are there, and the other two are. I'll make that one up, chuck that out again. Yeah, so I titled this fishing in the rain, and there's no rain. And no, I'm not complaining. <laughs>
Right, what rig should we do next then? That one. Well, I've got plenty of rigs and weights. Yes, it did. It was the pilot boat that snapped it. I didn't see it coming. And you can never hear them. Oh, for goodness sake, stop talking to me. I'm trying to get ready. Was it? Cracking. Thank you. But I've said to you before, just doing my videos, it interrupts with the fishing, and this is even worse. <laughs> well, you know, those people there want answers, and they, they, they're asking questions. Well, yeah. And I'm trying to fish. What am I doing with you? Am I actually making the video? No, I'm not. Am I doing a live stream or am I fishing? How's that Moses? Yeah. I haven't seen him in a long time. Hello, Simon's rushing. Has he got bait out? Yeah. I thought you were lure fishing. Oh, he's waving back. What's he got? What bait did he chuck out? Your line? Oh, I thought you were bringing it in because you had a fish, not because of him. <laughs> you did, mate. this rig in there. And that's a three up one as well. But this one's got small looks on it, like the other one, so it's not so easy to put a long worm on the small up. And I've got braid on to the braid spoiler. Hello. I've got a fish on the other rod now. Is it on? The rod was going. Is he on? Doesn't look like it is. I'll have a look at that in a minute. I'll just get this other rig out. going on about him? Yeah. <laughs> Mate, don't need to. Already done that. Yeah, I'm going to wait for a minute. The uh, Isle of Wight Prairie is coming out. Yeah. All right, have a look on this one, Dad. Oh, it's behind you. <laughs>
Here a lot, you expect to uh, catch seaweed. Encounter CV. Well, good luck with that. Thank you very much. Thanks for talking to us. That's all right, not Bye. a problem. Here we are. Sorry, there was no fish there. But you saw the vodka, didn't you? Yeah. And that's what you're looking for because that's the fish trying to get to the worm. We went fishing for mackerel once. And did you catch any mackerel? We caught a lot. Brilliant. And what time of year was that? Recently? Um, no, we went. Oh, okay. I have to see. It's a bit late now for Mackerel because they're normal. Was that, in, was that in, on your summer holidays or something? Uh, yeah. yeah, we went yeah. to the Isle of Wight on a, on, on a speedboat. Oh, right. I got seasick and so did my And then really? Dad um, did all the bits and we had it Whoa. for dinner. Did you? And did you like it? Yeah, it's really It's good. something nice, isn't it? When yeah. you caught a fish and then you eat it. Something special. In the barrel, so slippery. Yeah. yeah. They are, aren't they? They're really slippery. Did you get covered in all the green the green um yeah, scales and things all over your hands? And also there's a ton of blood. Yes, I had a, a nice big uh, rat earlier, but nothing yet. So you did catch a fish late earlier? Earlier? I'm not lying, he was about that big. He, he was one of the biggest ones I've had out of here for quite a while. I can't show you because uh, he's on the gallery and I'm doing this whole live streaming on yeah. um, YouTube. on YouTube. So I don't want to end that and then show you. But you can always watch me on YouTube later and see the autistic angler. Look, I've actually got a little sticker. You don't mind if I give your kids stickers? No, I'm not being anything other than fishing. Here you go, look, just so you can... 
It's only a little sticker, and that's the name on the YouTube channel. So if you want to look at the one later, then you can just have a look at that on there. Do you live in Portsmouth? Um, she lives in Southampton. Southampton? Yeah. Good place to live. I was born and bred in Southampton. Mm. But I'm not allowed to say that around here. Mm. Whereabouts in Southampton do you live? I, used, I was born in Bitton. I'm um, Walton. Just down the road. Yeah, by the bridge. Yeah. yeah. No, don't think so. No, I hope it isn't there. Because she's no. got seaweed a couple of times, it's probably seaweed. I was too quick for that one. Did it manage to get away? Yes. Probably pulled the ragworm out of his mouth. I remember Ian once cut his finger on it. Oh, yeah. Hook. It got... Um, when we went um, mackerel fishing, the hook got caught on my dad's finger. Did it? it yeah, it made it, it bleed. Did you have to go to the hospital? No, it was only a small cut. Was it? Yeah, it was exactly. We did it and then the fish blew over. It got caught on my cut. Really? The thing, because it was quite windy. Remember yeah, those blubber dots get everywhere. Remember when he cut his fingers, the fish just flew over to the other side yeah. of the they were like They were like really, um, like, the fish had like little shiny squiggles. Mm. <laughs> my feet are soaking. Yeah, we went, um... We went up to uh, a big tower and my brother got his feet so clean. You just called him Buddy. What was that on the other one? Uh, no, it was like just a minute ago. Oh, right. That was so That one? Uh, a big tower? Oh, right. Um, it was all the way over there. Near the big tower. And I was. Oh, I know what you mean. It was like a little flood. Yeah. And I started walking it. I only realised it till it went up to there. <laughs> and it got soaked. Thank you. Well, we're quite lucky because it's meant to be raining today. It was chucking it down earlier, but it, yeah. it's all right at the moment. So have you caught one fish? Just the one fish. And that was almost as soon as I got here. I saw the fish and that one of them, one of the people, one put their fi was brave enough to put their finger in yes. the Yes, well, you saw it. Yeah, I was just there. Yes, I don't know why he did that. They've got nasty teeth. Yeah. Because those ones eat, eat shellfish. They, they do you all... get a cut? Yeah. They crush all the shellfish up. What you should do is when I've the seen water, one do it before. When the water it was on land and um, I saw it had some food out of it. All right. Yeah, when the water's really calm, if you see um, small circles going out, then um, that means there's a fish in the water. Also, I stepped in a crab a couple of days ago at the beach mm -hmm. and it nipped my tie really hard. Did it? And it yeah. really hurt. That's the number I put in my sandals and it broke. Big crab. I don't like catching crabs when I'm fishing. They, they eat in. all the bait. Yeah. My sister, um, uh, when she was in the water in Lansing, when we used to live in Lansing, she was in the water because we hit a hot spot. Do I? Don't panic. And it pinched her thumb and it. Um, Really? Really young, but it really hurt her You should always pick them up by the back, so they won't be able to reach it behind yeah. you. Yes. The only it's part, they can just go like that. Yeah, that is the way to hold a crab, isn't it? At the back. Yeah. We went to a beach once, and there was thousands of crabs that lived in the water with us. And they, they were so small, I managed to find about ten that were really? tiny. Soon. After coronavirus, I'll soon be doing fishing. Will you? Yeah. Fishing's good. I have my own little um, rod. Yeah. Now that boat's back. I think this is probably just seaweed. Probably. I think it's a fish though. That's not really a fish. How's that? Never mind. How does it always like turn? 
Yeah, how does it pull it to the ceiling? Well, when you're bringing it in, if it's a fish, then you can feel it vibrating, you can feel it moving. But if it's seaweed, it's just heavy. You got it going. You're going down. Yeah, Alright, cheerio, take care. Not a problem. Yeah, I don't know that I'll be using this big but here. It's um dangling up. Oh hello. Well, well, You know what, looking at the amount of worms, I think I'll stop with this one for the minute. Where's all the comments gone? Do you know how I can get my comments back to see what they're saying? They should almost do it. No, they, they come up and then they disappear. Oh, hang on. Ah, here we go. What's all that say? Fish on, where? <laughs> buddy, buddy, buddy. Is that you? There you go. Sorry, it's just be kind enough to give me a squid. So, now I don't know what to do. I guess I'll have to fish with bits of it. <laughs> there was lots of bites. <laughs> On what? On the little one? Let me just put some more worms on this one. As Simon was kind enough to give me some squid, I can carry on fishing. I didn't bring the plastic worms down either today, so. Oh. I need extra. I need. That's gone. I need binoculars to see what that's saying all the time. Oh, hello. That's a long knot. What's that all the time? It's quite. Oh. Uh, no. Yeah, I always. Am I? I always give the kids lots of time. Because they're the next generation. Thank you very much. Somebody was just talking about me talking to the kids. Oh, it's nice to kind of give them a bit of encouragement, something they remember. Mate, there's not enough people do it. No. Well. You can't speak to me, you know. No, 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 it's not that thing. I was just looking at the top of that post. Look at the big tackle around the top of that. Those white, some sort no, of you're going to get up there then. No, you get a big ladder. Oh, yeah. Down there. Well, not collecting tackles. Are you still on for sure? Yes, 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 yes. yes. Go, Joe. No, 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 no. no. <laughs> of course you haven't, not yet. No, you're no, going to no. turn up with it and just say, well, bye. Oh. <laughs> so, do you know where we're going? Yeah. Only on the podcast. Just
Like a bit of scar on me. Are <laughs> oh, yeah? Yeah, well, <laughs> Right, just having a chat with Vinny. So, we'll... Have a look at the bikes again. Are we at a high tide yet? Uh, yeah, well, I don't know. Another hour, thanks. Another hour to high tide then, guys. I guess it's quite a high one, because the seaweed's covered already. Yeah, I missed that because I was chatting. So let's concentrate on the fishing this time. 
down. We've got a bit of squid, so I might tip with a bit of squid because that will. Who's he shouting at? That was the gospel ferry crossing. Somebody in his way. Can't see anything out there. So as I was saying, if I stick a little bit of squid on this time, then it should make the worms a little bit tougher to get off. As you know, I do that when I'm um, on the beach. There you go, we've got a couple of little bits of squid. I'll go through twice with the hook if I can. Lovely and messy. Look at this, they've got to like this. By the way, if you can hear it right now, it's got nothing to do with me. Right, what's these comments all saying then? Yeah, the comments, where are they gone? Bye. Really? You know what, I can't decide whether to keep the coat off. It's not quite warm enough. Well, straight out, get the bite on this one. So we'll leave that one there. There you go. Right, oh, maybe I should hold it then. They're going to go for that that quickly. Right. Come on! That's better. Go on. Go on. No. No. Right, I'm going to leave it then. Yeah, I think I've got into some weed. It felt like it when I put the rod down. Yeah, move it out of the weed. Leave it. Let's have a look at this one down here. Yeah, I'm getting bites on that one now. Not confident with this rig I'm using on this one. No, no fish on there. And look, the rig's all tangled up. Uh, I'm not going to use that one anymore. I've got my tackle box. Let's have a look. Have I got any cotton buds in there? Right, you know what? 
Let's make a quick rig up then. So I've got a cotton bud. So we'll just cut the cotton bud in half. So I've got two cotton buds. There you go. Shouldn't take long. I'm using 20 pound amnesia. I'm not going to bother what colour um, beads I put on. I normally like having the same. Run a bead down. Bit of cotton. Oh, hang on a minute. I need little swivels. Nothing like coming fishing and not being organised for it. Ha! I've even got the same colour beads as well. So there we go. Swivel. Oh, I haven't got my glasses with me. Missed the number nine, the B. Is that an onion sack? Yeah. yeah, watch out for it. Coming your way. There's one standoff boom. Then all I've got is bent GD clips. So that's going to have to do. So this can be the one down. Have I got another? Yes, I've got a swivel there I can use. On one of those snap swivels that I don't like using. So it looks like that other one's not in the, not got bait on now. I better look at that first. Right. Now nah, that was in the wing. Oh, we got a fish on. That's a surprise. Another ballot. But this one is a lot smaller. Oh, that's cool. That's the sort of size that I'm used to catching down here. Actually, it's not a ballot. It's a cork wing. And I can say that was thanks to uh, Simon's squid. Because that stopped them coming off. That little bit of squid I was cutting up then. Oh, 
got your manure pigeon. That's a good one. Alright. By the way, you're on Express FM. Yeah. That's local, isn't it? I don't know what they're doing, playing Scar. Right. Let's get this one back out again then. Right, let's get back to making this other rig for this other mod then. I'm going to put the pliers. Right. So where is that little... Uh, there it is. Don't like using these things, so I'm going to use the... Uh, the swivel off of this. So I got myself another swivel. Right, so how many have we got on? 80. Well, thanks for watching, guys. Wasn't expecting to get anybody watching me. I'll be in the right place with that one then. They're not biting. Give that a little move then. There you go. Moved it, get bikes. There we go. That looks like a fish on. Keep trying. And the bikes to stop, so I guess I kicked the bike then. But I'll get to that in a minute. So that's the rig. 
made. Just going to put the snooze on now. Yeah, not worry, that was me. So we'll stick a little um, secret up. Size for chino. Feels like there's a bit of rain coming. As soon as I might finish with this, uh, got this other rig out. I'll uh, put the coat back on. I've got a fish on there then. Certainly looks like it, doesn't it? Definitely looks like it. Ah, that will be a yes then. Oh, for goodness sake. Hang on a minute. Fish on. No, nothing. Where's the other hook So, that one's all tied up to. All right. Thanks, Mike. Another ferry coming in. Where would I get to this? Oh yeah. We've got one hook done.
No bites on that yet. Not in the right place then. down before knocking over. Quite surprised I didn't do that. So, second up. I don't know why that one's not uh, being bitten, so let's just move that. Yeah, in the weed of course. Moving out the weeds, see if we get any bites. Meanwhile, we can now bait up the other the other rig. Uh, that one's not catching anything at the moment, it's not getting any bites on it. And I don't know why. So how are we doing then? 85 people watching. Thanks guys. I don't know what I've done here. How did I get that in a notch? There you go. There's a lot of muck in the harbour at the moment. Right. So there we have it. Two hook caught mud rig, just made up. So I'll chuck that one out into the deep channel. Let's see if that catches anything then. Now the other one's moving. So that one's gone right out there. That boat won't come out if it's worth for a while. Now, is it the fish or is it seaweed? It's heavy. It didn't, it wasn't acting like a fish though. No, that's because it's seaweed.
Right, that one's out. Just get that bit of worm on up. Like that. Did you get that onion sack? No, it's a bit heavy. I think it must have snapped the line. Yeah. Well, I just know you, mate. I thought you might have picked it up. Well, I didn't put the glove on Right. So there you go. So we'll chuck this one out again. No, we won't. We'll put the eye through the blooming... the swivel through the eye. I'm going to lose that eye, but not careful. Right, try again. Just out past the, the post. Don't seem to be getting much interest in the deeper channel. So, there we go. Two rods fishing. Yep, cool. Let's have a look at this. Then. How are we doing on here? 86 people. How's everybody doing then? You all alright? You can see the rods, can't you? So I've got a boom rig out on the longer rod and a dropper rig of the shorter rod. Good. There you go, bye. Oh, the pilot boat coming in. I think I'm going to be alright this time. Hang on. Get my knife ready just in case. It's bound to take me in here after I just made that rig up as well. No, I think I'm going to be alright. Looks like I'm well down deep in the ditch. Got away with it.
There's a bit over there. <laughs> no, it's not. That's not your mind. Yeah, yeah, alright. Hey, yeah. I have that. It was on top of me towel and I was flicking the flies away. So, these are in the wrong place then. Now that's one. Car, but. Ooh, what's this? That was obviously all caught up. It's not going to fish if it's caught up. The crabs have got to it. He does get excited when he reels in, doesn't he? Oh, hello. Big comments. Are they, are they for me or are you talking to yourselves? Oh, I can't see them. Where's my comments gone? No, that's fine. Yeah, I love pulling pedals as well when I'm on the beach. Not here when I'm just messing around using up the worm side. Doing that, it's got to be the old cotton buds. By you. Absolutely gutted. Mrs. B told me they've banned cotton buds now. So when I run out of the uh, stock of cotton buds, I won't be able to do them anymore. Blah, 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 blah. All right, okay, whatever. So, this one, I'm going to chuck in a lot closer. Lot close. Lot closer, just down there. So, I'm between the post and me now. That's got to be 20 foot out. Let's have a look at this one. You get bigger fish in the deeper water, obviously. But you don't get many of the little fish out there. See? Untouched. Bottom one. A bit of squid on the top one. So we'll just chuck that straight back out for a moment. Take that. Uh, move this one in close hasn't helped, has it? No. Ah, oh, there you go. Too much weed in close. I'll stick it back out where I was getting the stuff. Just move, sort this one out now. Well, that's there. This one can go just. Might try to post over there. I know what to do to get a bite in. Just get something to eat. Yeah, do you know what? The two hook flappers do catch all sorts of stuff. I've had big hounds on them and all sorts. Right, come on then. Fruit and nuts out. Where's the fish?
I'll stop the coat on because it's getting a bit cooler. Right, this isn't looking so good then. I don't know why we're not getting any more brass bikes then.
I've got too many worms left now. But I wasn't expecting to catch more than two fish. <laughs> yeah, it does say, doesn't it? May contain nuts. Oh! The bot boom. Uh, not that one, but that one just got as well. Bite on the little one. I definitely saw something happen on the big one. Like a look at that, go on, keep going. really small fish. I ain't going to go any smaller than the uh, size ball room, so. That's the old harbour boat going around. There you go. Thank you, Dobby Bats, for the fight on that one. And this is the uh, flapper, uh, the um, cotton bud one, the boot ring. Can't feel anything, but it's gone down twice. And the big berry just going out. So let's have a look at it now. Catherine, as you bring stuff up out the water. Worms sit on the bottom hook. Yeah, that's what it was. A little fish have taken the worm off. They've eaten it around the um, squid. That's right, this was the one that it had a couple of good knocks on it, didn't it? Shut this big one out. Not big one, shut this one out. Towards where the ferry is. There you go. So he's out in the deep water. Liddy's having to go with back from feathers. Should he be lucked up? I've got the feathers with me. But it is a bit late in the season. And then a friend of ours had some this week. Yeah, this is the pop not having dribbles on. These cartridges quite do move around. Oh, 
Uh, just because I can, I'll stick this lot out. There's a couple of worms just without the twin. Just about there. That's where I was catching them earlier. Did I just see that log while I've done? I've had two rats so far, a really quite big one for here and a little one. There you go, nodding again. And that's the worm without squid this time. Just thinking, does this thing tell me how long I've been going? Yeah, hour and 55. That's gone quick. Seaweed fish again. And the hooks are clear.
I think I'm going to go back to put bits of squid on as well, you know, because they don't clear the hook so quickly. Police roads coming out to Camper Dock. Simon, how come you didn't complain to him then? <laughs> really? Yeah. No, he comes in well close, doesn't he? Gone back to tipping with bits of squid. And I think that went out far enough. I'll leave it there for a minute. That's not a surprise because you do lose a lot here. Right Sorry, mate. Messing about that. Smugglers, smugglers. I'm surprised we haven't got a pub around here called the Smugglers. You normally get them any time anywhere there's water. <laughs> Sorry, that was apropos nothing. I said that was apropos nothing. Oh. Smugglers. One big rass, one little rass, mate. There'll be loads of around, won't you? Yep. No, I don't... Dunno. I've lost two rigs, though. Yeah, well, I was fishing here, mate. That's what happens. You know that. They're bigger than white bait. Yeah, okay. It's a shoal of something. Yeah. Is it? Maybe. I think that's just a basket. 
It's coming towards you, look. Just here. Looks like minnows to me. Or sticklebacks. Mate, come here. Please. Quickly, before they go. Identify, look. Oh, right, okay, yeah, a little smelt, yeah, yeah, quite a lot. Yeah, so there's, a lot there's loads of them. That's what Tom was in about doing, getting his cast there and using them as Yeah, right. they'd be really light, mate. They would be, wouldn't they? Should I put a little hook up so I can? Could be a bloody bit of it. Yeah. Oh, you might foul look one if you quit with a... Yeah. So there's a, there's a shoal of something down here. <coughs> Which Simon and Billy reckon are uh, small smelt. Can't see. Baby pout, something like that maybe. Couldn't tell you about that. The small somethings. So that one that I've just chucked out is just a one hook on the bottom. A bit of a one in length, I think. But on a size four again. But it's only one hook that time. Gah. Oh, here's something you might find interesting. There's a boat just coming in. And it's got one of the old um, wind farm, wind turbine blades on it. They make them on the Isle of Wight. And then they take them up the harbour to go to be craned onto a, a special boat that takes them out around the world. Yeah, it's only when you see them like that you realise how big they are. Anyway, back to watching my rods do nothing. So, gas. I better tie another um, dropper loop rig. I don't know why I'm not getting any bites. Probably get plenty here. Just not getting the bites.
All right, mate, thanks. I don't think I'm out far enough for it this time. Say that. Yeah. Hello. What was that all about? I just had a stupid big thing come up saying you're live. I know I'm live. Wow, he's cut the corner. Is he going to get my line? No, he missed me. There we go, there's a two hook flapper on a dropper rig. Just tied it with one of my rusty cartridge weights. I'll put a loop in the end and then that's ready to go straight on that uh, single hook rig on the little rod. So I really don't like single hook rigs got down here and not on the bottom. There's knives blood. Right, let's bake this up. The corn roots are still out there anyway. So that's that one. So that's that one. Putting a bit of squid on the end of these two. Right. Let's bring this one in. Swap over and put that uh, rig on that. Yeah, no surprise there. Nothing on that one. Oh, this is good. There we go. Tied it up. Now I'm going to cast it out. See if we can catch a fish on. Now that's back to where I was catching them, just about there. So, you have a look at that one. 
Well, I get the other one in. To see what the, the latest comments were. Yeah, I am at the moment. But they said it was going to rain all day, and it hasn't rained yet. Actually, it did rain earlier. It's just not rained recently. What I should have said. Okay. Looked like I'd crossed my own line for a minute then. Didn't think I had. Yeah, I have now. Or have I? Oh, I don't know what's going on. Yeah, lots of little fish jumping out of the way. And the hook's gone. Why has my hook been cut off then? Siren, crabs cut the hook off? No. How long is it? 20 pounds. No. Look. That's a good way for There's no telltale little thing on it. Yeah, no. Well, what's that about then? They're not quite a good way if I just cross it. No! Hello. Hello. That was a bite on there, wasn't it? Yeah, it was. That's looking... Whoa! That's looking a bit fishy. Might have one, I'm not sure. It is, it's only a small one. No, I don't think I have. No. Yeah, they need it, because they don't know what they're doing. Yeah, so the hook got uh, mysteriously cut off on the last one. Right, another record.
go get it? Oh, for goodness sake, I felt it. They let go of it. That was frustrating. Right. There's fish out there, mate. Didn't you find fly yet? Oh, I thought about that. <laughs> I was just imagine it using lots of power to do. Yeah. You know. I've got my, my old. I better plug that in. Here's a question. Well, you don't know, I guess. I'm not being horrible. Phone went off, I've got a message. How do I look at my message without losing my, my live stream? Oh, better ask a teenager, mate. I've not a clue. <laughs> <laughs> not a clue. Ah, <laughs> Alright, okay, you reckon this should still record, but I'm not sure, mate. Oh, I'm not going to touch it. No, no. Probably only going to be Mrs. B. She knows I'm live streaming. Oh really? Well, duh! Of course she does. Has the tide changed yet? Is that water down? Because I've just chucked it right by the pump, and I think I'm going to regret that. Yeah, but he just reminded me. Um, I better plug you in to charge you up. Sorry about that. Need to move that so that you can still see what you're doing. Right. Yeah, this is a nice place to fish. But there's fish around. I'll put this one. Still loads of fish jumping out of the water as I can reel in. I'm going to go to the other side of the post. In deeper water. So I've got one more to the left of the post and one more to the right of the post. To be honest, I thought I was going to get a lot more bites and fish than this. There you go. Did we get it? I don't think we did. No. Son. Gave this live stream the wrong title then, didn't I? Yeah, 
Yeah, it's not so good. It's going to move it down in the tide now. Oh, for goodness sake, I'm getting a bite on the other board. They're a bit few and far between. There's another one. So that's a ballon wrasse again. Not as big as the first one. A bit grey this one. Brilliant. Moved yet. Can you see the more tips there? I don't know why, but I'll get a few bites then. Don't think I was getting anything on this one. <laughs> We got another fish coming in, guys. <laughs> another ballon bass. Hang on a minute. So there you go. There's another one. So they seem to be on the bite now then, don't they? Two and five minutes. Again. They seem to be on the bite again. No, that looks more like seaweed, doesn't it? Got on here. 
Have a look. Yeah, getting bites on that one straight away. And uh, nothing on this one. Oh, look, empty. And the wing, yeah, it's starting to mud out now because it's obvious that the uh, tide's going out. And that was. Fortuitous to use long worm for the day because this is the last worm. But I've got all that squid that Simon gave me. <laughs> but this is doing the job quite nicely, using up the worm. Might be one or two other little bits down there. I won't chuck those out very far now then. Now that the tide starts to fall. Oh. Oh. Yeah, that's just see it. It's the tide putting them around now. But I can't see any, any other worms here now. I think this is just bits of peat. Oh, that was a fish. Yeah. Is he on? It's difficult now because the tide's put it so hard. It's only suddenly done it. Is he on air or not? And I do believe he is. I do believe he is. And that is a nice surprise with the tide running. And so that's another ballad. So they're still out there. Look at that beautiful eye on it. Right. Whoop, whoop. You've been here in a minute then? Yes, mate. I've just had three in about five minutes. I was going to say the water's beginning to clear a little but bit, isn't it? But it's pulling very hard to the left now already, yeah. look. Yeah. Because I've only got these, um, those on. What yeah. do you call them? Cotton bud rigs. No, no, no. no. This, oh. that thing, the cartridge weights. Oh. They're not okay. gripping. But then again, if you put, yeah, you lose but it. But that one was going round when the fish hit it. Oh, okay. It was it was moving. Perhaps the water's still uh, chucking. Well, I'm not going out too far. No, no. Because I didn't think it'd be fishable once it's. No. It? I didn't think it'd be. Yeah, this. Got a bite on this one. Yeah. I didn't think it'd be fishable once the tide started going because it starts pull, yeah, pulling yeah. so hard. Yeah, but it's perhaps it's pulling the fish, the fish coming out the candle or something. Mate, I have no idea. No, I have. He's getting bounced along. Is he? Yeah, I've lost count now. I, I haven't had a lot, have I? I've had yeah, four, five, I think. Five, maybe? I'm not sure. No, I had three then. And two were yourself. Five. 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 Yeah, yeah, five. That, big one. That, that, big one. That, that, that first big one. Yeah. Mate, how many times have I been fishing that I'd love to catch five fish? Oh, yeah. I've had another message on here. Hello to all the latest people that are on there. 
I haven't got my glasses, but it looks like 90 people are on there now. And um, I've had five rats now. Five? Hello. I don't know if we're going to get any more because it's um, it's rushing round. But. That's all the worms used up there. It's going again. It is going up. Let's have a look at them. No, I don't think so. Oh, really? No. Missed it. Still got a couple of bits of worm on there, let's just chuck it out. Yeah, so I just totted up with Benny. I've had five brass so far. Now this one's going now. That looks like... Can you see them? Gotta love these size four chinoos. They don't have to catch the fish. of tentacle I'm going to put on here. That's really tough to pull off. This sun's come out. Fishing in the rain. Ha! I got that title wrong. See the squid tentacle is so tough, it's difficult to get on the hook. Right. Hello. That's uh, an inquiry then. a bit of worm on a hook from the other rig. 
from earlier, the one that got all tangled up. Something happened to bite on that one. So this is the result then. I've used all the worms up. And caught fish on them. Now, I didn't really think this through. I could have bought some of my other bait out from the other night. But that's all in the freezer, and I didn't think about bringing any fr freezer bait out. But at the time, it was chucking down, and I thought it wasn't going to be a good day. But this has turned it out. Yeah, definitely bite going on there. Not even have a fish on that one, guys. Right, let's have a look. It's turning out to be a bit hectic. Because I've started eating my nuts, isn't it? Have we got anything on here then? Yes, we have. And another one. Simon, I'm trying to catch you a pouting, mate, but I can't do it. I'm only catching brass. Do you want this one? Okay, look at that. Gorgeous coloured cork weed. Look how blue they are. They're gorgeous, these things. Yeah, I'm not getting them that small. <laughs> See, does he want this one or not? He's not going to chunk it up. No, no. Hello? Mm. Hello? Hello? There you go, there's another one. No, he just, he's just, you know, lost. Yeah, 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 I understand that, mate, but you see, I'm not getting them that small. So I didn't know I was going to be this lucky then. So that's six altogether then. Yes, I have had six. What was it? I think it was three man and a three corporate, wasn't it? I can't remember. But that's all the worms used up. So when these come in, all I can put out is squid. And I don't know that the rats like squid. Do rats eat squid? Yeah, I've not caught them. I know pouting coming on squid. No. But like, yeah. Around the corner, it's Jennifer. Thank you. 
Have I missed any bites then? It seems oh, I had a funny 10 minutes, didn't I? Hectic. Oh, there we go, just as so I said that. There's a bite going on over there, look. Now here's a different species for you, Simon just caught it, on squid, a little goby. Look at that mouth on the damn things. And I'm going to have to go to squid soon. Hello, I can smell sausages. I knew this. <laughs> Another clonker. Look at this one. Nice really nice. Way. This one is slippy. Can't get the hook out now. Ow! I knew that was gonna happen. Where's my pliers, Bob? Here they are. Grasp with a the headache. There you go. And he's got to be three quarters of a pound, I reckon. That's another ballad wrestler. Lovely fish. And everyone swam away. So this is a result, so that's seven then. It's really two good sized ones. I didn't think I was going to get him after the tide turned though. Cool few then, mate. They're rasped, eh? Yeah. Yeah, so 
All I've got left now is squid. Thank you. That was a nice one. So I've had two fairly big ones and I think five little ones, is it? Seven now? Seven, something like that. Oh, have you just caught squid? Here's me trying to untag with this rig. I don't think I'll bother. Don't worry, I'll pick it up. So. I'm now not expecting to catch anything. Now that uh, I haven't got any of the worms left. But. It's fishing, you never know. And like I said, I've used the worms up, which is the whole point of coming out. Now I've just chucked that one, I'll bring this one in and check this. And then I'll start putting bigger bits of squid out. Well, this one's stuck. I was saying to Simon, around here I've had quite a few uh, pouting on squid. So I'll chuck this out into the deeper water because I haven't had any pouting come right in here by the uh, seaweed. Just the, uh, what do you call it, the wrasse. Because the wrasse love the seaweed. So I'm just going to do two nice strips of the squid. And I'll uh, sew that onto the hook three times. The, the first one I'll just clip over the eye. So I've got a bit of brass, a bit of squid hanging down like that. Like this, I'll stick out in the channel where the ferry's done, but I'm expecting it to be moved around a lot by the tide. But that's fine out there. I have no idea if we'll get anything beyond that. And of course, I know the bass watch me, but.
Yeah, it's just after squid now. I don't reckon my chances, but it's now either. Mm. How many have we got on now then? Is that 91? Wow, ah, that's a lovely surprise, and thank you all for watching. Squid. Oh, I think I've got a fish on. So what's this then? It's just eating squid. Definitely got a fish on. Come on, what are you? Been gone for the summer. Wow! Look at the size of that one. Holy cow! I was not expecting that. That, I think, is my biggest bream of the year. Brilliant. That's my bike day, that has. God. Rock and roll. Fantastic. Wowzer, wowzer. Oh, I wasn't expecting that. Oh, this has been a rather good session then. Wow. What mod is this? Oh yeah, that was on that spinning mod. I thought that felt good. <laughs> oh, my God. You gotta love fishing. Just coming down to use the worms up. What fun. Oh yeah, and this was a rig that I tied while I was there. You tie yourself a, a quick old uh, two-hook dropper without swivels, just tied it onto the braid with a blooming cartridge weight and you go and catch a fish like that. Fantastic. Ah, oh. absolutely love it. What a blow. Yeah, 
I can't see a damn thing now. I'm sorry, I can't read your comments. One, I haven't got the gla reading glasses, and two, the sun's in my eyes. Right, let's try again now. The sun's gonna be on the clouds. Yeah, sounds like I should have kept it then. Brilliant. Yes, it is a great session, isn't it? I'm loving it. So we've had two really good bream and one good size... No, sorry. Two really good size wrasse and one good size bream and a handful of little wrasse. And I wasn't expecting to catch anything on that squid either. I didn't know the, the bream was still around. Brilliant. Can't get over that. Let's put this way. I don't think I've got my glasses in the bottom of my bag. Oh, do you know what? I've only got to find my reading glasses. Chucked them in the bottom of the bag, didn't I? Thank you, Pat. No, I've never eaten premium either. Hello, Smash. I don't know. I've never had a red mullet here, only on the beach. Look at that. I can now read all the comments. Hello, Christine. I certainly am having fun. No, it was a black broom. Thank you very much. Look at all these comments. I didn't realise. Thank you, everybody. Brilliant. So, 96 people are watching. I've been on for three hours and four minutes. I've had a really good session. Thank you. How many times a week? Wow. Um, it's like every second or third day. Keep my glasses on. It's not my... Really? Do you not get them up in Scotland then? How many times a week do I go fishing? Well, have a look at my channel, you'll see. I seem to put up the videos two or three times, no, every second or third day. So that'd be two or three times a week that I go fishing then. How's the wife? Yes, she's um, in a lot of pain. Um, we can't wait for her her operation to come through. She's feeling a bit hemmed in, you know. But she's fine, thank you very much. 104 likes was 96. Fishing in the sun. Yes, I would have to change the name, wouldn't I, Chris? Well, it was peeing down when I left home, as you'll see from when I got here. 
and I got soaked the other day and they said it was going to rain. I don't know how to stop this thing swiveling around. They said it was going to rain for five days solid, so I wasn't expecting it not to rain. And I certainly wasn't expecting to catch all the fish anyway. Right, I'm just going to go and check the bait on one of them. Oh yeah, that was the other one. Bikes are coming, not so often now. But I wasn't surprised to be honest, because I wasn't expecting to get anything on the, the squid anyway. Can you see, no you can't see the tips can you? I wonder if I move this charging port over to this side. How's that? Is that a bit better? Really? Well, the nearest one to me. See, this is the problem when you're doing this live stream. You're looking at the camera and you're not looking at the rods. So this left one, that's the one I just put those longer strips of squid on. That well, I can't see anything. Where did I put my glasses? Oh, there you go. No, it was me moving it, was it? Thank you. Whoever said that. Oh, for goodness sake. There you go, that might be a bit better. Yeah, sorry for the uh, any little problems I've had today, but this being my first fishing live stream. I didn't bring a tripod, I just bought that um, J Joby Gorilla thing, and I wrapped it round this um, bit of railing. But it doesn't, it seems to be like moving a lot. Did you? <laughs> Battery power of 15%. Okay. Well, I guess that thing's run out then. I've got another one here. Just going to swap you over onto the other battery pack. Don't get excited. See what that one does. Do you think so? 
I'm not sure. South Coast, one, two, three, or whatever you call South Coast Angler, one, two, three. I found it a bit awkward, a bit difficult, especially with my problems and everything. Because I'm getting loads of people look at me weird here. And the other problem, I wasn't sure if the phone would record all right, because the last time I used the phone, before I bought the expensive cameras, I was getting an awful lot of um, wind noise. So I, I bought myself an external mic and I was trying to get that working because I didn't want the wind noise. So I'm not confident about using the phone to do this. But anyway, I hope you've all enjoyed it so far. I don't know how much longer I'll stay here. If I don't get any more bites, probably not too much longer because I was only using the worms up. I think I was just lucky to catch that bream on the squid though. Really? Thanks, Pat. Thank you, Christine. And Keith Fisher, George. Well, somebody asked me if I was going to, and I've had a couple of people mention it, so I thought I'd come down and have a go. Because I needed to use the worms up today, I thought, well, why not? Rather than lugging my big camera down here just for using up this, I thought it would be a good opportunity to go live. Unfortunately, I caught some fish fuel. That's good to see. Biggest problem I've got is there's a couple of messages on the phone. I don't know how to look at the messages without losing the live stream. Probably Mrs. B saying, Where are you? Thank you, people. Really kind of you. I've got a question for you all. I was having this chat with somebody the other day, in fact a couple of people, about doing a live stream and also doing a video of it at the same time. And I said, what's the point? YouTube posts this live stream video up as a video. So if you want to watch it, it's up there as a live stream. So while I'm going then, want to do a, a shortened version of it and the only thing I could think of was maybe somebody didn't want to watch and sit and watch three hours of video and they wanted to watch 18 minutes but I thought for me that's way too much to do the live stream and 
to do the the video. So the question is, is it worth it? I know um, Danny on Inglorious Fishing does it, but it just seems weird. I'm talking to you, then I'll go off and I'm talking to the camera for the video instead. So what do you think? Is it something I should try next time? Or is it pointless? Because I reckon it's pointless. Really, Pat? Well, that's the same with me. Thank you, Danielle. Danielle? Dan Daniel? Pat, that is the, the same with everything for me. The first time I do something, because I'm not just autistic, I'm, I've got anxiety as well. So I get myself in an absolute mess when I'm doing something first. But once I've done it, I'm okay for then doing it again. Thank you. I'm gonna keep pressing the button to get these chats up. Oh, right, okay, the best clips, yeah. But the trouble is, it's an awful lot of extra work. I don't want to bring the, the camera down, do all this, and then have to go home, having worried about doing this, and spend another few hours editing another video. But I know what you mean about watching the best clip, the best bits, because today would have made a brilliant video. But I don't need to make a video of it, because I've been live streaming it. And I think for the moment, I'm just going to stick with this, do one or the other. Like you, somebody just said. Do I have a bite, by the way? Yeah, this one's doing something funny. Now that looks seaweed. Doesn't it? That's not fishy, is it? No, I don't think so. Nah. Seaweed. Anyway, me being me, I'm just going to stick with what I feel like doing when I do it because it seems to work and you seem to like watching me do stuff anyway. No idea when I'm going to go out next or what I'm going to do next, but I didn't plan this one either, so I'm going to have to stop and think about this for a day or two. Mullet over in my brain. It's been unusual for me, very unusual. Knowing that there's, what is, what's on there now, 94, 84, I don't know, 84 people watching me talk to my, my phone. It's just weird. Yeah, I'm going to bring that one in. Oh, get off my knees. And um, sort the weed out on it. Yeah, there you go. There's a bit of weed just there. Caught on the line. We've got a funny double tide in this harbour, as we have around Portsmouth. It's stopped going out for the moment. Just for the end of it. Oh, that's quite out there. That glorious bit of autumn sun. I was going to say winter sun then. Right, let's have a look.
Is it? <laughs> Thank you, Adrian. That's very kind of you. Really? Thank you, Uda. Uda? Uda? Uda, isn't it? Did you, David? I'm not sure about the fly fishing videos. It doesn't get a lot of um, likes, to be honest. But I'm going to carry on doing it. People can skip through easily, can't they? Yeah. Take a deep breath. <laughs> yes. Oh, yes. Deep breaths. The story of my life. Take a deep breath. That's what they've, all the management courses I've ever been on. Stop, take a deep breath, Martin. Oh, my. This is a good time to catch them as well. I did bring some feathers, but I really can't be bothered with it. Karen just flew over there and he's fishing. He dived into the water trying to get something. He's a bigger turn than the ones I'm... <coughs> Excuse me, the ones I'm used to seeing. Here comes Victoria's white again. The old big green and blue one. Not quieter this one than the old ones. Car fairies I'm talking about. ready anyway. Ready to cut it again.
what does that all mean up there then? Ah, oh, there's a lot of people gone. Never mind. You've all got stuff to do anyway, sir. Have I managed to fix your fishing tent hole? No, not yet. I, I was going to do that this afternoon. Uh, Graham. Have you managed to fix your fishing tent hole? Great live streaming, Martin. Thank you. Watch your fishing video of night fishing in South Sea. The way the weather was terrible. Yes, it was. No, I haven't tried fl fly fishing for bass. Good fisher... It, Fishing in the winter is not winter yet, Daniel. It's autumn. Thank you. Yeah, this is Portsmouth Harbour, Daniel. Are they, Samuel? They're entertaining. Oh, I don't know. I don't know, mate. I've, um, not, not a problem, Philip. Smash, I don't know about fly fishing for mullet. It's not something I've tried to to catch. It's probably a bit late now anyway, isn't it? I, I thought the mullet were, um, a summer thing. Okay, Philip, cheerio. And everybody else has got to go. I know you've all got stuff to do. And like I say, I expect I won't be that long, that much longer to be honest, because I wasn't going to be out here for long. And I've got these two messages on my phone I'm going to look at. I don't know how I can look at the messages without interrupting the live stream, but... Um, is this wind affecting the, the stream at all? Are you getting a lot of wind noise? Because there's a bit of a wind blowing now. I'll be fascinated to know how that's effective stuff because I'm paranoid about having this um, external mic working because I was worried about the wind noise affecting it. So is it affecting it then? Is it? Oh, right, okay. That's a surprise. Well, if you haven't got much, uh, then I might be tempted to try it again sometime then. Oh. oh okay. Well, that is a surprise. Because on my early videos, all I could hear was wind noise using the phone. And that was one of the reasons why I, I, I got the expensive camera. Never mind. <coughs> See, there's the third message just come through now. Don't know what to do about that. Do you know what, guys? As you've been... As I've been live streaming for so long. I'm going to see if I can get to the the messages on the phone. Um, and if it messes around with this live stream, I'm sorry. But I'll try and get back to it. So I just want to try something now and, and see if this see if it works. Okay, it says the stream was interrupted, but I'm back again. I've read the messages. So I guess it does interrupt the stream and it affects it, so sorry for that. Mm -hmm. Oh great, well I'm not interrupted again.
Thank you, Udo. Yes, I am back. Okay. Well, like I said, I was, I was trying to see if I could answer my um, my email, my messages, but it means that it interrupts the chat, so I understand now. And then you can come back and it and reconnect it or resume the, the thing. So again, it's the process. I understand the process now. I don't know if you can see this, there's a big ferry coming out, there's a little boat stuck in the middle of the water, and a police thought to rush into it. But it was, I heard sirens and everything, there he is rushing to it. I hope feels like he's not fishing, he'll get into some serious trouble. Put it alongside him. Yeah, you can't mess around up there because those police launchers are out all the time guarding the aircraft carriers and they're manned as well with guns can't see what's going on here's another question can I zoom in? does that zoom in? I don't know, does it... I can't see, but I'm going to move you back to the mods. Vinny's come back, so I'm just going to have a chat with him. Oh, wait. Oh, I have zoomed in. That's cool. Right. When you left, I caught a black dream about that big. Seriously. It, it needed two hands to hold it. Oh, nice. It was a massive group. That was on the tips bit of the squid that I left out. Oh, really? Yes. Cool. I couldn't believe it. How's he getting on around there? Oh, terrible. He's having a lot of that. Don't worry about that. Yeah. Right, um, yeah, I'll come out to get this. Dave's turned up around there. Oh, was he? How is he? He's alright. I'm, I'm just going to get around to see Martin. We're back here in a minute. Simon's going to pack up fishing and go home. I'm going to come back here with Dave, probably. That's fine. Right. And I've, I've got a bit slight, well, good news for you, bad news for me. I've I just phoned up the bloke and he said, 
he said to me, he said, he said, you can view it tomorrow, he said, but the bloke who's with the keys and that is going, you can have a look at it, he said, but you can't go in it and run it. So he said, and no one's going to be there after 10 o'clock tomorrow. And I, I said, okay, I said, don't worry. I said, we'll leave it for the moment. I said, I'll ring you in a few days time when you can get the keys and get a better, I don't know, because I need to run it, I need to drive it, whatever. Because you can't make a decision on something you can't run. And then he said, no one's going to be there after 10 o'clock. And he said, and if you can get there before 10 o'clock, he said, you can only view the outside of it. You can't go in because we ain't got the keys. And I thought, okay. He said, and also, he said, the guy who put this other deposit down has been on the phone today, he said. He said, saying he's going to put the money in today. So he said, I really don't know what's going on. He said, I've been up front of you and all, he said. But he said, my boss told me to keep to worry is it because I'm getting others in so so well, is that okay so mate you're pissing water all right. so, sorry so best thing to do is oh, no, no, no. But do, you, do you want to go there before 10 tomorrow no 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 we'll leave it I said I'll do it and I'll leave it but I've, I've, I know it's sort of like it's, I don't know it's just like you or anything so right. in short you're not going to see it tomorrow now no 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 it's still, it's still, it's still, it's still, I'm sure I'll run that over to the top. Yeah, I'll be back in a little bit. Yeah. Well, he will. He will. I've said to this lot, I don't know how long I'm going to stay here because I've not got any good bikes. Oh, okay, that's that free. But he was a good size free. I'll be back in a little bit. I've got to give this to him free. He was a good size. He really was a good size. My English will be the TV. Really? Oh, well, I'll have to watch the video later on. Well, it'll be more than that. Yeah, because I was thinking before we come up with it. Yeah, all right. So I missed, I missed that with the old um, little boat then, because I was talking to Vinny. Yeah, sorry about that. I was talking to my friend because he had asked for a lift to go and look at a, a camper van, a boat home tomorrow. But we're not going now. Anyway, you've seen video on the videos. God, I'm getting old. That is, not doing much, is it? Well, I think I will give it a... I don't know. Andy being next to a beer locker there.
Yeah, that police watch has gone back to its station now. Thinking about it, when he came down to chase that boat out of the way, they all moved around to make sure they sit at the cordon on the aircraft carrier. But they don't like boats getting close to that aircraft carrier, I can tell you. Get very touchy about it. That's cool, I didn't realize I could zoom in on the live stream. Get the asshole going then. Right guys, you know what? I think I will end the stream here. So I'm not going to do anything else. I'm going to pack these rigs up. <laughs> pack these rods up. What I'm going to do now is find out to end this live stream. So, to the 59 of you, or wherever you are that's still on there. Oh, what was that? <laughs> right, people. That's okay, Pat. A massive thank you to everybody that's watched it. I really appreciate all your support. And thank you for all your kind comments. And for the moment, then, that's me done. <laughs>